What's up guys, Nepenthes here and welcome to the first ever Player of the Month FIFA 20 video. To my surprise and probably your guys' surprise too, maybe some of you didn't even recognise, EA have released Pookie Player of the Month already. Uh, they've also released uh, Marky Matchup, so straight off the bat, two uh, brand new and very live uh, SBCs. We're going to complete both Pookie and Marky matchups today if we can. I've only got 12,000 coins, but I've got a few players in my club already. Uh, if you guys want to check out my streams later on tonight as well, link will be in the description below. Mixer.com slash Nepenthes. I'll be streaming all night. Uh, tomorrow, we're going to have How to Start Ultimate Team episodes one and two, giving you the breakdown of the best, most efficient way to start your club, get a good gold squad for rivals and um, squad battles. And... Uh, Apart from that, guys, welcome to FIFA 20. It's here. Download it. Get on your early access. Now, the first thing to note about Pookie is it's very cheap because right now the players are very cheap. Um, but how long is it there for? It's there for 27 days, which is absolutely fine. The, lo the longer you wait in the immediate term, the more expensive it's going to get. Because even right now, like some 84 rated cards are going for like 2,000 or 2,500 coins and stuff. And you only need for this card an 82 rated squad with 75 chemistry and one Prem player, and then an 82 rated squad with 65 chemistry. Now, on the flip side, it doesn't give the best rewards. It gives two premium goal packs, and that's it. But the card itself, I think, is great. I think this is going to end up cheaper than what Lucas was last year as our first player of the month. The player of the month design, brilliant. Problem with Pookie is he's three-star, three-star. Uh, I haven't really played much FIFA 20 yet in terms of gameplay, so I don't know if that's going to be a genuine problem Um or anything like that. Um, we've got high medium work rates, which is very good. He's 5'11", which I think is very, very good. And his in-game stats are very nice. I think that this is going to be a card that can be everyone's main striker for so cheap for a long time, especially if, like me, you're on a budget and doing Road to Glory, because 94 positioning, 90 finishing, brilliant. Good pace off the bat, so a Hawk chemistry style will be good. 90 vision and 90 short passing. So his passing is going to be nice up in the top end as well. His agility and balance are good. His reactions are very nice. His ball control is decent. He's got 85 stam, which is great, and 76 stem, uh, strength, which is great. So if you want to boost his composure down at 77, you might want to. A sniper might be the way to go. But I think uh, a hawk might be really, really good for him. And like I say, he's nice and cheap. And then we've got marquee matchups as well. And we'll, we'll talk about the marquee matchups too. But first of all, I want to just show you guys Pookie to start with. So it's very easy to get that Premier League player off the bat, isn't it? Um, I'm, I'm still trying to figure out a little bit how this stuff works. I've got a couple of loans there. This Jordan Henderson for me right now, I'm going to use because he's untradeable. Um, now we only need an 82 rated squad. So with 183 rated player, we can get away with a little bit more. I'm going to take, I'm going to go for a few more Premier League players as well. I don't really care too much about the position. I don't particularly want to use, see, I'll, is there no way to add a player and then like I, I i don't like this i i really i'm i'm not i want to add jones and then click to the next section but it just it just won't let me we're going to add cabaselli in there as well um let's put him up there let's put him in there uh, i am going to take just basically most of these premier league players that i have uh, i don't really want to use dinye or oh, maybe putting it on the bench will work so loftus cheek can go in yeah, see, it just, it just, it takes that little bit longer, that little bit extra, and I don't really like it. Uh, you might notice, oh, hold on, man, you're putting in a lot of, like, 78s and stuff in here. You you would be right. Uh, but the reason why, and uh, the, funnily enough, the reason why I was talking to you guys about, we only need 75 chemistry, so we're fine. The reason why I was talking to you guys about 84s being cheap is because right now I've got a couple of 84s that are um, really cheap. So uh, Felipe and Pizzi are nice and cheap. I think Felipe was coming in very, very cheap. He was like 2.7k bin when I was looking at him. And we've got a whole bunch of 81s as well in there uh, that we'll be able to throw in should we need to, a couple of 80s and stuff too. So we can bring the uh, bring the team rating up quite comfortably um, when we need to, however we need to, with 79s and 80s and so on and so forth. But when we look at Pizzi, um, compare price, I mean, 2.3k, not even selling. It, like it, He's going for like 2,000 coins or so for an 84, which I would assume that when I put him into the team here, it boosts our, it's going to boost our rating up just way high enough. So that puts us to an 80 rated squad. So I have got a fair bit of work to do here to improve this squad. I could probably just put in Felipe as well. 
And does that take that keeps it as an 80 rated? That's quite surprising. He's part of the issue there. That does lose us a little bit of chemistry. Let's pop in uh, Payet over there as well. Um, that's still 81 rated. I'm going to need a little bit more chemistry, really. Forget the rating specifically. Um, we'll be able to get the rating in pretty, uh, sorry, the chemistry in pretty easily. We are still 81 rated, which is a little troubling. As I say, I did half expect it to be a little bit higher rated than what we've got available so far. Um, we're down to 62 chemistry as well, which isn't either the best. Let's pop him in instead of him. That's still 81 rated. So I might need a few extra players here. Um, and so in terms of the league, maybe I will use Digne. Digne. Uh, he'll be good for uh, he'll be good for chemistry and should be good for rating. He's not even good enough for rating. He doesn't even get us anywhere near the rating that we need, nor does he get us anywhere near the chemistry that we need, sadly. Let's swap those two around, get a little bit of a chemistry boost on there. And let's swap those two around and those two around. That takes us to 64 chem. That takes us up to 70 chem. So we're basically going to need a striker. Um, maybe is 81 Payet going to be enough? So 81 Payet is enough in terms of uh, rating. But let's send him to the club. See, can we even have a look? Is, an, is a 79 going to be enough? No, that's still only 81. And then, of course, we don't have any strikers that are up to that uh, that regard. So I'm going to need a couple more 80 or 81 rated players. He will link, actually. He does well for a link. Let's pop him in there. Um, let's pop Felipe in there. That's 65 chem. Let's get that Spanish right back that we had as well. So we can throw him in too. Uh, Mario Gaspar can go in there. A 70 chemistry, 80 rated. Is Dembele going to be enough? That's 82 rated, only 71 chemistry. Is a 79 going to be enough in here? No, so I'm going to need at least an 80. Um, which again is going to prove to be a little bit of a problem. Unless I just go and get another 80 or 80. Let, let me just check for an 80 rated player first. I don't want to sort by striker. I just want an 80 rated player. That's not quite enough. So I'm... Oh wait, he's 79, 80. So an 80 rated player is enough. I've got anyone that actually links. Yes, I have. He can go in there. They can swap around. And that is the first part done. So I, I know I'm using 284s here, but because they're like barely 2k each, this is only like a, I'd say like a six or 7,000 coin squad. Using Digne is probably a bit stupid, right? Because I will pack him so many more times. Yeah, he's he's about 3k because of Digne and, and who he is. He's Premier League, he's 83 rated. Maybe a little bit stupid, but that's the first squad done there, guys. Um, <clears throat> what we're going to do after that, we're going to open the pack straight away because I'm, I'm going to need to try and get the player out of it, of course. Uh, what I'm going to do after that is I'm going to go ahead and... So we get a rare player at least. I don't really know how to tell if it's a board or not a board. All I know how to tell... Oh, hold on. Brazilian, centre-back. Have I just got a walkout? No, it's a board. So it's Miranda. We get an 83, which is really nice because we can now use him. That's not bad from the pack. We can use him in the next squad. And uh, I, I don't think Footbin um, currently have um, this on there. Wow, that's really nice. Two 81s and an 83. Lots of players. A couple of fitness cards. That's not bad at all. Um, yeah, I don't think Footbin currently have... Um, oh, they do. So t Footbin, according to Footbin, he's 17,000 coins which is really, really cheap. Um, what we're going to go and do is we're going to go and purchase some of these players because they are really cheap right now. And using Footbin is never really the best way about doing things because they're going to get more expensive because of Footbin. But we basically just need 183, which we've got, and then a whole bunch of 82s. Now, for this one, it's actually even less chemistry. Before I go into the market, let me go and have a look if I can do this um, without doing it. And what I wanted to do for today was kind of... Um, was kind of play a game with Pookie, but I don't know if I'm going to. What I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go build this squad and then I'll be right back. All right, guys, welcome back. I have built the squad. What was really interesting is these guys are cheap, man. Oyarzabal, we picked up for 1,000 coins. I think Adariz was less than that, 900 coins. Like, this is coming in cheap. Santi Cathola, 900 coins. Uh, Danny Garcia, 750 coins. So after you get that 183 rated card, which obviously we packed with Miranda... It, it's crazy cheap. It, like like I say, Footbin has, has got it coming in at an extremely cheap price. Uh, 17, 17k or so. Um, which I think for how good that Pookie card is, is well worth it. On top of the fact that you get two 7.5k packs back. Uh, so you can't really knock that. And wow, look at that. I, I, 
I think this is a much better way to announce the card than what we had last year. Um, Player of the Month, Premier League. Does he walk out? Or is that all we get? Hey, fair enough. I rate it, though. Um, yeah, I like it a lot. Uh, I like it a lot, a lot. Uh, I think this card has genuine potential to be a, a brilliant early game card. And we're going to pop him into a team and have a look at him. We've got marquee matchups as well, guys. Uh, I don't think I'm going to do marquee matchups right now. Uh, and, and I want to kind of go to marquee matchups and explain why. Uh, we don't get a rare player out of that one, sadly. Marquee matchups is coming in at about 12,000 coins on PlayStation from the start. Oh, we get perfect link in there. Very nice indeed. Don't care about that. Don't care about that. The Real Madrid kid might might be selling maybe, maybe 200, 300 coins. Not that I care about coins on this account. This is my pay to win account. So I'm not really uh, too fussed all that much. But um, rules of play. High FIFA fan. Don't do things that you shouldn't do. Fair enough, EA. Um, what do we complete there from season objectives? We completed another foundation objective, guys. Another, another, uh, another um, easy uh, early early game objective. So, <clears throat> in terms of um, Pookie, what I want to do is get him into this squad on 100 chemistry. Let's take him, uh, swap him out for Danny Ings. I love. I, I like, honestly, I'm I'm blown away by how cheap he is to get and how quick and easy he was to get. Uh, I'm gonna. I have a uh, chem style now. One thing that we haven't seen is whether or not the chem styles still give the same boost. Now I'm gonna apply sniper to him. I think because of the boost that it gives in composure, that that might be the one. And yeah, look at that. He goes up to 99 finishing, 99 positioning, 92 agility, and 81 balance with 91 reactions, 87 dribbling, 86 ball control, and 82 composure. I know he's not bang out fast, but you're not going to be come up against defenders that can deal with that kind of pace anyway. Um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. It's, it's still the same boost, so the, the boost hasn't changed. I think Sniper on Pookie is amazing. Uh, and you know what? I'm, I'm half tempted to just build the team as best I can and go into a game and, and give him a shot. Instead of doing marquee matchups, we're going to go into a game. We're going to get some highlights. So let me put a team together real quick, guys. And I will be right back. All right, guys. So here we go. My first opponent. Man, he's already got Vertonghen. He's got Lone Sancho. Uh, 100 chemistry, 80 rated. Probably a better team than me. I have got my Lone Aubameyang and obviously player of the month, Pookie. Uh, I've got my Virgil van Dijk in there. Um, but I haven't got any chem styles added other than onto Pookie. Oh, this is new. This is interesting. Uh, I haven't got any custom tactics or anything done. I haven't even really played FIFA. Um... So I, I don't really know what's meta, what's overpowered, uh, like others, other than just playing a football game. Obviously, it does, you know, th this guy could be bad at the game. Uh, oh, I don't have the, the names that I want above the heads either, so I'm going to have to change that um, in due course. There's big tackle from Big Verge. But most importantly, I want to get used to... I want to I wanna understand how Pookie's going to play here today. I want to I just get him on the ball. So, we're, oh, okay, this guy's just absolutely rinsed me there. And a lovely goal. I did not expect. Oh, he's skipping replays as well. I'm telling you, I've come up against somebody who uh, who I don't really want to be playing against here. Um, I, I'll, I'll be showing you guys the highlights. Oh, he's, he hit. Oh, my God. Look at that through ball. Werner is just killing me. What a save. Not like this. Oh, he's missed an open goal. And yeah, we're getting, uh, we're getting absolutely battered off the bat. But I'll see. I'll pass that out left. That's lovely from Pookie. Here he is with a shot. Oh, what a goal. Timu Puki with a banger. Absolute banger. I'll do this guy the, the credit of uh, skipping the replay as well. But that is a sensational strike. His, his long shots aren't even like that amazing either. Let's see if this thing still works. Playing it into the left back. Chipping the ball all the way down. Do you know what? Oh, that's lucky. Puki onside. Puki! Oh, I've greened it as well. How's he hit the bar there? I thought that was a, an easier scoring opportunity than the um than the first the first one there. Oh, that's lovely. Go on, Pookie. Bang that. Lovely goal. 2-1. Let's go. And Pookie with another one. And I tell you something, even though I took that first long shot, wasn't great. I took that long shot that he scored from. I hit the bar with a timed finish, but he's just leathered that. He has absolutely lasered that into the back of the net. And player of the month, Pookie. Already has two goals for us. Very nice. 
I've won managed to win that. Oh, that's beautiful play. I do like the fact that the Ronaldo chop is now three star. And I think it's fair as well that it's three star. It's not like it, it's a move that a lot of people uh, do and use. Who's this guy got here? Bitten court. It's an easy goal for him. Yeah, I mean, the, the pace is the pace is just too much. So definitely if you can get in behind your uh, your opponent, you're just you are away pretty much. That's nice. That's really nice. Got Puki! Look at him shoot, man. He's got power. Puki with the hat trick. That's a lovely goal that is. And that is he's got some power on his shot, guys. Obviously with the chem style, it's 99 power, but that was really nice. He's brought on another absolute speedster. Fortunately, these guys have only got pace and don't really have much else about them. Oh, what is that for a pass there? Oh, man. I mean, I, I, like that, that seemed like a very simple pass. Oh, now he's celebrating at 3-3. That's interesting. That seemed like a, a very simple pass up the field to an open guy that went about three, three yards. Um, and then a, a good finish from Werner. The pace... I know this is very early days, right? Very early days. But pace seems like it's going to be a very important factor as a foul ref, surely. I've read that. just couldn't quite get there. Ah, uh, I can't believe I've let him, let him score. This guy, this guy's just putting through balls past my back line. My back line is really, other, other than Van Dijk, of course, my, my right back, my right centre back and my left back obviously just don't have pace. Not that Jean Moutinho is pacey himself, but he just keeps threading the balls through and, it, and it's very, very difficult to deal with. Go on. Oh, that should have been it. That might be game over as well. That might just, just about be the end there. Because look, look, he's got those runners coming through again. Yeah, that's it. It's just got too much pace for me. Uh, have, having those players up front, that's sad. Fair play to him as well. I, as I said, you know, I kind of made the made the, the point at the start. His team was a little bit better than mine. I know I had uh, Aubameyang and Van Dijk and Pukki, but other than that, my team was was garb. And he's definitely had a lot more game experience on FIFA than me. I'll pick that up as time goes by. But what was nice was that Pukki got a hat trick. Aubameyang got three assists. Um, and just in general, Pukki was nice. Let's take a look at his goals again. Uh, just to have a look at them here. Lovely little drag back into the space. And he just absolutely bangs this. Top of the box. So much power. Just drives that into the goal there. I then took the lead for 2-1. I think, did I go 3-1 up as well? I don't know if I did. But Pookie here, boom. Another just absolutely drilled shot to make it 2-1. He then equalizes with Werner for 2-2. And then Pookie here again. Lovely play between Aubameyang and Pookie. The beautiful drag back into the space there. And another just first time bang into the back of the net. So for 17... 15 17 000 coins um you are getting yourself a player that is going to be very very instrumental in your team in the early stages in my opinion so there you go guys that is going to be the end of the video for today if you enjoyed it be sure to leave a like rate and comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already lots of fifa 20 content to come throughout the course of obviously this game cycle but tomorrow we're going to have uh how to start ultimate team episode one and two the next day my first draft thank you guys for watching hope you enjoyed it. if you did be sure to leave a like rate and comment subscribe to my channel if you haven't already but for now guys i'm out peace